Queen's Gambit declined, modern variation, 4, B75.NF3H66.BXF6BXF6. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed Black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. White overpowered Black in the middle game. In the English opening, White plays c4 to take control of the d5 square without sacrificing a central piece. This is a more patient opening. The pawn push on d5 is ready with e6, and the bishop on the dark squares can advance. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. Nf3 controls the e5 square, advances the knight toward the center, and helps the d4 pawn. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. A pawn kicks the opposing bishop, forcing it to move or risk being captured. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. Recaptures. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is the final book action. This defends the pawn that was attacked. It is ideal. There must be a more effective approach to train a bishop for growth than this. It is incorrect. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is excellent. As a result, the bishop grows and gains flexibility on the long diagonal. It is ideal. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. It is ideal. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. It is ideal. This misses a chance to make a pun winning threat. It is incorrect. Backs off. It is ideal. A powerful play. It is quite good. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. By attacking the enemy knight, this activates a piece while also buying time. That's good. This defends a knight who is being attacked and is not well defended. It is ideal. This threatens to win a pawn. This allows the opponent to develop a piece while also winning a tempo on a queen. It is an inaccuracy. This activates a piece and simultaneously wins time by attacking an opposing queen. This is the only good move. This threatens to win a queen. It is a great move. The queen is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. This is the only move that works. This threatens to win a bishop. It is a great move. This could have been done lot better. It is incorrect. This can indicate that a knight was attacked. It falls flat. This allows the opponent to pin a knight. It is a miss. This adds pressure by pinning a knight. This was a game-changing move, giving white a winning position. It is a great move. This reveals an assault that poses a threat to a bishop. It is ideal. This is the way to win a bishop. This is the only good move. It is best. Backs off. It is ideal. This wins a bishop. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. That's a decent move. That's good. It was a free pawn there. It is ideal. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. It is ideal. Capturing that pawn wins material. It is best. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed black in that one. Both players had an amazing opening. White overpowered black in the middle game.